Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another news video. We do this every Thursday, collect all the adventure quest news I can find and put into one big video. Let's get into it. All right, first off, if you did the quest line last Friday and you thought that the merge items costed a little bit too much and the quest didn't give too many rewards, they have balanced that out more so it's easier to get the merge items. So if you want to go get those armor, helmets, and I think there were some weapons and stuff there too, those are a lot easier to get than they were. Uh, this change happened on like mm, Saturday or Monday around there, so you should have known about this, but... Uh, if you didn't know about it, you can go back and get those merge items really easily now. Alright, with the bonus ACs coming out for this month, you're going to get these packages this month. Also, if you have last month's Brood Fiend package, which will be going away very shortly, this will be coming out on Friday. Uh, the dark version, of course, high tier, blue the low tier. And there are bonus ACs up to 6k extra ACs. Uh, this does not apply to membership or Amazon purchases, so make Keep that in mind. Moving on. So we looked at this armor last week and we saw a video of it, which I, I kind of, Chris, I, we lost a lot of videos last week, uh, but here's like a better picture of it. You've probably seen this already, but here it is. Love the hairstyle, love the armor. I asked for a version without a sword. I thought that'd be cool. Cause I don't know, maybe like you don't want the sword. You just want to be unarmed or something. Or you just don't, like, don't want any cape. Because normally I run around with no cape on. Uh, so he said maybe. <laughs> That's what he told me. So we'll see. Uh, here's some hood options for that same armor. I really love the elf ears. Looks very cool. And another armor from Exos. Really cool, unique looking dragon themed armor, of course, for the female. Uh, we'll have to see the male version of that also. Looks really nice. Krulong coming at us with some dark armor. Uh... I don't know, this might be themed around one of the dragons in the future release. Maybe we're going up against like a dark kind of magic dragon. The sword looks really cool like that. That might be an animation. I don't know if that's static or not, but that looks sick if that's an animation. Moving on. Uh, if you wonder where the Lost Princess story went, uh, that's going to be next month. It's got replaced by the seven dragons, of course. Z has been working on some Null Gath gear. Looking good, looking good. Uh, you can see the blade or the pull. And I'm sure there'll be a flip blade with that sort of design too. Uh, looks very nice. Can't wait for that in the game. All right. Uh, if you didn't know, Dragon event is this Friday. I like to include what the event will be for Friday, even though most people know. But yeah, it's gonna be dragons for the next uh, next few Fridays. You got seven of these events. All right. So done with AQ Worlds. On to Adventure Quest Three Dimensional. This is a new race of NPCs for AQ 3D. Uh, sort of a raven person. Looks kind of cool. All right. So this is kind of a joke post, but uh, they said new controller support we want to add, uh, which basically hints that they want to add legit controller support, probably to the phone and to the computer or the PC on Steam. Um, so they probably want to add both because I know there's uh, controllers you can get for your phone and uh, of course you can plug in a controller to your PC so adding controller support to the game would make sense and uh, it would be a win-win so hopefully they add that I'd probably use it I, to be honest like just to chill out controllers you can lean back in your chair you don't have to like lean over your desk to use it a lot better uh, so not a lot better but a you know, more relaxed way to play the game I think that'd be a cool thing for farming if you want to lay back and use your controller. And last but not least, some new AQ 3D items. I really love these swords, and they're adding also wands to Adventure Quest 3D. Uh, Sethro, I think, said that these wands were going to be part of the dungeon, the random adventures. So I would assume these swords would be also. Uh, this one sort of looks winter themed, so maybe that could be with the winter dungeon. Who knows? But uh, they could be probably rare drops or something. That would be my guess. Would that these would be rare drops in the random adventures but uh yeah that is all for this week guys not a lot of like crazy news nothing really too appealing to me uh but tell me what your favorite part is maybe i missed something tell me that in the comment section below thank you guys for watching we will be back here tomorrow for an aqw live stream like we do every friday and of course the news will come on this channel next thursday as well hopefully we have some cooler news next thursday thank you guys for watching
And I'll see you guys all in the next one. Peace. Oh yeah, if you're uh, wondering why, no face cam. I am very tired right now. I look like I'm high, uh, so I just don't want any comments like that. So I'm just gonna just gonna leave this at the end there. Just tell you guys that yeah, th that's why there's no face cam. Sorry if you want to see my beautiful face, you can check out the Twitch vod link in the description. Shameless plug. I stream every day on Twitch. Check it out. Peace.